Alex Britton, I'm going to ask you to please give him a loud round of applause. Alex Britt. I'm 13 years old. I come from a family of three generations of law enforcement. One day, I hope to make it four. My father's currently serving as a patrol sergeant for the Yarmouth Police Department. My grandfather was a sergeant for the Massachusetts State Police, and my great-grandfather was a lieutenant for the Quincy Police. Seeing what's on the news about the violence set towards the police, and knowing that over a hundred police officers have died this year, makes me scared for my father. It's definitely scary knowing that he goes out there every day towards, towards harm's way, putting on that uniform to protect each and every one of us from it. One of the things that makes me feel better is knowing that he loves what he does. This here is my great-grandfather's badge. One day, I hope to wear one just like it. So thank you, Dad, and to all the men and women in law enforcement who protect us every day. we have here is the thin blue line. How many are familiar with this and its meaning? You are, excellent. <laughs> We're going to just go over this real quick. What we have here are three distinct, well, rectangles. They each have a meaning. The bottom black rectangle is evil. It's the bad guys. Uh, people that want to try to take what's not theirs. They want to take yours. They may seek to harm you, or they may harm you while taking your stuff. So this is the bad guys. The top black box are the good guys. Look to your left. Look to your right. These are you and your neighbors. They're the hard-working people that help other people when they can, take care of themselves, and work hard to build a nice, healthy life. In the middle, we have a blue line. And you'll notice the blue line's a little bit thinner. It's the thin blue line. There are a lot more good guys and a lot more bad guys than there are blue guys. So that's a, that's a significance here. So what I'd like to do at this time is ask our police officers to come form a line right here in front of the trailer. And that will represent at least a small portion of Cape Cod's thin blue line. And while and while these officers are lining up, I would like to mention that when we conclude here, the helicopter is available. If you want to go take a look at it. I mean, how cool is it to have a helicopter here? Again, take a look. This is part of Cape Cod's thin blue line. Many of their colleagues are actually working for them right now, possibly, or they just got off shift, or they're getting ready for the going on shift. 
They work weekends. They work nights. And I'm quite sure they're volunteering their time right now to be here so that you can meet them. So I ask each and every one of you, let's start over this end to your left. And if you'd like to, just walk the thin blue line, shake a hand, say I thank you, whatever comes to mind.